Now we can talk. Is there medium heat? I think there's only on and off. Perfect! <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Um, it is Friday today. And today starts a new episode of Cooking Apart Together. So, um, I thought of a recipe today, which I'm gonna show you in a bit. I'm gonna call Steffi on Skype now, and afterwards I'll be going to the gym. I'm already changed, except for my pants. But anyway, I'm gonna go, uh, go and call Steffi and see if she's up for my recipe. Who knows, who knows? I've been in the in other countries for work and I've been really really busy so I have some catching up to do on YouTube as well. Really been missing you guys. Been lacking on comments and feeling so bad about it. Well just missing you. Um, I mean work goes on because I need to make a living. But it was fun and did a lot and today is the day that I'm kind of be able to do everything, every computer work that I haven't been done able to do. And which also gives me the opportunity to take a little time for breakfast and um, go to the gym in my break, which always makes me feel refreshed to work on further. But without further ado, coffee and Skyping to Steffi now. Did you also just text me? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Set. Go. Hello, everybody. Welcome to a new video. We're going to cook a part together again with another breakfast. And this time, I'm going to show Steffi how to make an awesome dish using croissant dough. So, Steffi, what did you get? What did I get? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And even perfect. Yep, those were the ingredients chosen. And even though we have a different croissant, it will gonna be awesome. But I have to admit. This is the first time I'm trying it out myself too, so that you will have to just hope for the best. It'll be awesome. I'll eat it. Whatever turns out, I'll eat it. <laughs> okay, I can do that. Yeah, me too, I think. <laughs> Fun fact, this is even from Luis. I'd say let's put it on medium heat. Is there medium heat? I think there's only on and off. Perfect! <laughs> okay, then we will need one scoop. Or I took 20 grams, I think it is, in of uh, chocolate whey. And we're gonna make two versions. So for the other one, we're gonna use, a, let's say a tablespoon of cinnamon or half a tablespoon of cinnamon and half a tablespoon of sweetener. I think just two good teaspoons will be enough. Okay. Cinnamon and sweetener. There we go. Perfect. 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 And then just add to both of them just a little bit of water until you just get like a sticky dough. Oh, and a pro tip, warm water mixes better. Okay. Oh, it's casein, so I really need a lot of water. <laughs> that stuff is so thick. 
I think I have my water intake for the day here. Okay, it's perfect. Ooh, it's like pudding. So I have like this consistency. Which looks pretty gilly. What do we do? We grab the croissants. So we get two croissants from the dough. <laughs> Just take two attached to each other. Okay. <laughs> Interesting. So with some parchment paper you can roll it out a little flatter. Yeah. yeah. Just like cut it in half. Mm. You need to show me what you're doing. Okay. <laughs> I don't know you're what right. to do. You see it? Yeah. Okay. okay. So I'm placing this in the half of the, the of the dough. Yeah. Like a good amount, but not as much that I can close it, but the scoop of protein goes in perfectly. Yeah. yeah. And then I'm pulling it over. Yeah. Pressing the pieces here together. And you could use, which is pretty convenient, or easy. A fork. Stick it with a fork. Okay. okay. And that way it's sealed properly. Yeah. yeah. So your gains won't come out. So mine is warmed up. Perfect. I think we'll have to try to place one at a time because they're gonna be expanded and big and melt together otherwise. Okay. Maybe I could do it the same by the way. I think I can place two in. Oh, there's protein coming out. Protein! It's leaking! Well, that's good. Hang on there, Waffle. So, waffles are ready and they're smelling really, 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 really good! That's because we're hungry. Yes, we are. I'm gonna take them out now. God, they look so good. It has become one giant waffle, babe. Oh my god. This was a perfect idea, Luz. <laughs> I'm glad now you Now I'm excited it. for the filling. Back online. Back online with the end result. Yay! So these were my recipe of today, made with Stuffy, of course. Um, I think we'll just call them croissant waffles. They smell pretty awesome, they look pretty awesome. So let's see how they taste. They smell amazing. I'm gonna try the cinnamon first. I'm gonna try whichever one I have because I don't know what's inside. <laughs> Good idea. I incorporated some peaches and placed on some. I put apricots in there. Yeah, that was what I meant. Ah, so we did the same actually. Mm-hmm. Mm. This is so this is really good. It's like the best part of the croissant, the crispy. The crisp and everything's crispy now. Chocolate way with... No, you have the chocolate pudding. Oh yeah, I have the chocolate pudding casein actually. 
and with some uh, ahorn syrup or maple syrup. Look. They're yeah, both really good. So let's eat. Let's eat and and we'll try to find some, say it. Well, hold on. We try to find something new and cool for our next video for you. Actually, already have one or two new ideas for the next time. That is not surprising. <laughs> Just tell me what to buy before, and I'll get everything. I knew I could count on you, really. If you liked so, we hope you liked this video again. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe for more if you aren't, and uh, we'll see you in the next video. Have a great day, everybody. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye.